so tonight, probably for the first time since moving in here, the temperature outside has gotten a little cooler than the temperature inside. Part of that is because it rained pretty hard this afternoon, a nice little cool front came through, and part of it is because I have my thermostat turned up very high, so my air conditioning isn't on. But because it's a little cooler outside, I have an exhaust fan or a ceiling fan, attic fan, that exhausts into the attic. And I also have transoms. And I'm unable to open any of my windows. And even if I could open my windows, I don't have screens and I have Lilith. So she would probably go missing real quick, at least get outside. But I'm like, I have a transom over the front door. I don't have um, my camera on a tripod, so this could be a little wonky. But I have this thing that I found when I moved in and I think it's broken. I don't know what it, the end of it looked like originally, but I was led to believe that it was exactly for this purpose. Oh my God, you wouldn't believe the cool breeze that is blowing in my face through this transom right now. Now I know how those Victorians survived in Alabama heat. But I can close this and see it latches. If I want to unlatch it, and it opens. And then I can just use the stick. And the breeze is amazing. So my understanding on a very limited basis, now I have no screen in that, so I'm gonna close it before it starts, the bugs start to get bad this evening. Ugh. But my understanding of the concept of transom windows High ceilings, the heat goes to the top. At night, if you want to close your bedroom windows or bedroom doors, so you have privacy, you close your bedroom door and then you open the transom and maybe you crack a window, the bottom of the window. Now, if I could get my windows open and I had screens, I would open the bottom of this window that goes all the way to the floor because it's drawing in the coolest air from near the ground and especially that on the porch and then the transoms it'll create a draft it'll create a draft from that low window up and out the transom and then here's a transom so i could even shut the french doors if i wanted to this transom is, you know each bedroom has its own transom and then now, of course, in 1895, they did not have a attic, electric attic fan, but in 1895, this door was an exterior door to a porch, and there was a transom on there, as well, above there as well. So you could selectively open windows on certain sides of the house, prevailing winds, shade, etc. Again, those low windows that go all the way to the floor, open the transoms and you could get a wonderful breeze through the whole house, even in Alabama heat. But modern technology, I have an attic fan. So the attic fan, and I haven't opened all the transoms, but also between each of the bedrooms are doors. So there's a door to that bedroom, excuse my mess. and to the front bedroom. So even with the doors to the public space closed, you could open the transoms and that one is broken. Um, and close the doors to the public space and then if you needed the air between the rooms, you could, or you could close off the rooms that nobody was in and only have the air. So if I wanted to, I could close the bedroom doors to the other two bedrooms and the hall doors to the other two bedrooms. If I could open my windows in here, I could open the windows in here, open the transom, 
turn on that fan, whoosh, air through. But this little thing right here, right now this minute, is making me so happy because I could sit right here in this front hall and just feel this breeze. So the other goal is to get some screen doors or when I get the back room done, screens on the windows there, but a screen door in the front and the back of the house will do the same thing. Or open the screen door in the back of the house or open the door to the screen door in the back of the house where it's cooler because that's the east side in the summer and open this transom and whoosh, you get a nice breeze right through the center hall, front to back. Cause see that back door back there, this would have been like a shotgun hallway. That would have been the exterior door cause that room in the back used to be an, a, a porch. And oh my lordy, now I know how they, how they survived down here. But um, I was a little hesitant to open that for fear it wouldn't close again, but it will. So just a little lesson in old house living. And I'm really excited about it. So, cause I get excited about nerdy shit like that. But next, now my next goal, get some operating windows so that I can take advantage of this really cool feature and some cool cross breezes and such. <clears throat> ventilation in this house as it cools off moving into the fall I am not going to fool myself to think that August 1st is the beginning of the autumn because it isn't here down here but it's, it's a nice little reprieve all right thanks bye